after today, eight days remain of Dogtober. And I want to thank each and every one of you for watching the videos, watching the podcasts, dealing with the drama, whether it be dogs or people, because there's been some. Just thank you for being here. And hopefully we get to donate a good good check to them people. Furry Tales Rescue. This will, well, no, it won't be the last Dogtober. But it will be the last Dogtober like the past two. And here is the reason why. Beginning November, just sometime in November, I will no longer, on my other channel, be filming in that niche, if you want to even call it a niche. I've got new plans, and it doesn't involve homesteading, personal life, dogs, or any of that. And before I tell you what I'm going to do, don't, don't, don't delete me now. Let, hear me out. I, get off, get your hand off that button. Don't do it. Don't unsubscribe. Ten people did yesterday because they didn't like what I had to say about this country not making anything anymore. Well, that's the truth. But, yep, lost a bunch of them over that. <laughs> I don't get you. This form, I mean, the other channel. Okay, let me, let me, if you haven't watched my other channel, started out somewhat of a, a homesteading channel, even though I don't have a wife and kids that move from the city, you know, the standard ones you watch. I just film what I do. And basically, that's it. And it's grown to 14, almost, I think I'm five away from 14, two, 14,200 subscribers. You name it, I've done it on that channel. Yep. Built an addition, remodeled stuff, built things, tore things down, all kinds of stuff. And that's all right. Some of those videos were okay. But the channel just doesn't, I don't know. I did something at some point that pissed off YouTube and they will not just, they just won't let me grow. They grow, let me grow on subscribers, but not in views. And I'm sick of it anyway. I'm sick of showing my personal life. I'm sick of people finding out where I live, showing up. And that hasn't happened in quite a long time. Um. Uh, you know, people have, and they've let me know, Hey, we're going to, I'm going to stop by. And, you know, I had a guy reach out to me and says, Hey, I can get rid of those tires for you. I'm like, cool. Come on. And he came and he took them. That is fine. But in the beginning, man, people were just showing up and, you know, that's not cool for any YouTuber. You got to have some privacy. Well, here's my pitch. Here's what I am going to do. Now I don't need YouTube for an income so i could care less about losing earnings for a while i mean it's just i do it for fun i don't need it for and, and we're talking about the other channel right now i don't know about this channel yet so hold your horses beginning in november i am going to one video per week don't know what day doesn't matter ain't figured that part out yet and all i am going to film is things I'm doing out in that shop, laser engraving and anything else, any other kind of project that I do in that shop. And the entire channel will be related to that. There won't be no going out weed eating anymore. No more working on the kitchen. No more doing anything, not showing my personal life. It's just getting too crazy out there. I'm not afraid of nothing. But I'm just tired of doing that kind of thing, trying to think up things every day to do. When I could be out enjoying things, that's why I built that shop. So I could enjoy a new hobby 
something I might be able to make something out of, you know, if I wanted to make a few dollars, I could, and maybe help others. And yes, I'm brand new to that laser engraving, but I figure I'll start the channel as I'm learning. And that's all I have to focus on is that. So I've got a lot of time to learn. Uh, and I know that I'll get good at it. Anything I set out to do, I usually learn and overlearn. So instead of converting the old channel, Washita Mountain Living, to a laser engraving channel, I'm just going to start a whole new channel fresh, brand new. If it and I will send an invite to those of you that would like to come over and watch that sort of thing. But for the people that just like watching homestead things, well, then you probably don't need to go over there because I don't want to bring any of this stuff over there. If you understand that, I don't want all the, well, this, this homesteaders doing this. I don't care. I just want to focus on doing the laser engraving and that's going to be my channel. I don't even have a name for it yet. I could go ahead and start it, but I'm not going to, you know, so what you're going to see the next eight days or that's going to be it for anything that's going on on my homestead. Did I just say that? I did. And with me, and that doesn't mean I won't occasionally show it. You know, I know you guys like the dogs. I will always, always show my dogs in my videos. But beyond that, I want to just concentrate on being in that shop and learning something. And you guys can learn with me. And that's what I'm going to do because I have seen this month what this kind of channel gets you. You know, not this channel that you're hearing this on, the other kind. Uh, I don't want to do that kind of channel anymore. I'm not going to take the channel down. Those videos will, and, and I ain't saying I occasionally now won't put a video up on that channel. Updating what's going on with me. We can do that. I'm not taking the channel down or any of the videos. But I am going to concentrate on a different niche I need a new channel that doesn't have the shadow ban because both of these channels do to some degree. Uh, they just do. I tried to upload that video yesterday on this channel and it just got stuck in checks for hours and hours and hours and they were not going to approve it because I had a tank sitting on, on the thumbnail and I had the word W A R in it. So once I changed the thumbnail, it went through. That's because they censor everything we do now. And if there's something that may anger somebody, they won't let it go up. I don't want to do those kind of videos. I want to do laser engraving. Now this channel, I have not thought of what I will do with this channel. Uh, I've invested in this equipment, so obviously I'm going to keep this channel. But I may tone down what I talk about. I don't even know. Maybe I'm just going to talk about the lasers and, and things I'm doing. I, I don't know. Use it for a live stream. I have no idea. But I'm getting away from any type of homestead, homestead community type stuff, any of that. Uh, it's just what I want to do. And... When I do the laser engraving channel, you're probably never going to even see my face. You know, that ain't going to hurt nobody's feelings, but there's really in that kind of a format, no need to show your face. Yeah, I probably will. You know me and my humor. I'm going to have to do some silliness. Man, that's a good idea. I need to get a copy machine and put my face on it. And then laser engrave that. I bet those would sell like hotcakes. So let me know in the comments. Now, I am going to do this with the other channel. And like I said, I'll, I, maybe I'll put up a video on that channel once a month. We'll leave it up. I'm not going to take any videos down. I am just tired of changing names of channels, trying to change the niche. You got to have the proper niche. That's probably... One of my biggest problems on that channel is I, I am not consistent with what I'm doing 
And YouTube doesn't know who to show my videos to, but I don't believe that. I think they're shadow banning me. They're shadow banning me. But I don't, you know. Another thing is, I just don't have the stamina to do a lot of these things to make a whole video in one day. Uh, and I want to be able to work at my leisure. So... If I go to a weekly video on a new channel for the laser engraving, I could film all week. Excuse me. Take my time editing and make it a much better quality video. And just, you know, if you want to subscribe, there it is. I'm going to put the links to all. I will make sure you guys know about it. So if you're interested in that, I'm going to have that channel. Otherwise, you know. And I will make an announcement on the other channel. Next video I make probably. Now, nah, I'm going to wait until Dogtober is over. Because I know those people over there. They'll hear that I'm, oh, he's quitting. Oh, it's going to be a big drama. He's quitting. He's quitting. They're running him off. Nope. I just want to do something different. And, and that's what I'm going to do. Don't know what the name of, Give me some ideas for a channel name. Washita Mountain Laser. Doesn't have to be anything to do with that. And the dog man, we're going to phase out. We might leave it up on this channel. I don't even know what I'm going to do with this channel. I don't know if I want to keep doing podcasts. I don't know. I may just continue just the way I've been going. I need your opinions. But the projects outside and all that. And, you know, maybe that's what I'll do on that Washita Mountain Living once a month. Just take you around, give you an update, show you not, not necessarily the work. And sometimes that work that I'm doing may spill into the shop. Uh, making these for the window frames or whatever. So, but that's what I want to do. I'm pretty set on it. As I said, I don't need YouTube for an income because believe me, it ain't that much. This channel don't make squat. This channel makes maybe five bucks a video, if if that. Uh, and I realize I don't. This is a small channel. I don't have that many subs, but this channel is actually growing pretty good. So I don't want to get rid of it. I got these mics. I got the cameras. The podcast studio. We just need to think of. It. And here's something else I thought of, guys. You you always told me that I'm a good storyteller. I actually bought a teleprompter. And I was looking into maybe there are channels they tell stories, fiction, nonfiction. And there are stories online that average people write and they post them and you're allowed to use them. You enter that in the teleprompter, you know, and you tell a story, maybe ask you, what'd you think of the story? Something like that. But if I'm to do that, it's going to be a once a week thing, probably. And, and I think all the channels will be once a week after Dogtober. Uh, and I say that now because I'm, burnt, I'm burning out because Dogtober does that to you. But I'll make it. Let me know your insights. Be nice. Uh, you don't need to go run and unsubscribe, but I am going to do that. We're going to chill out the Washita Mountain Living channel. There will be videos posted on there, just nothing like before. And I am going to go ahead and start up a laser engraving channel. And I will need subscribers to get that going, to get it monetized, in which I don't even really care. But unless you're monetized, you don't get all the, the perks on YouTube. The, they don't put you out for the viewers. And so once I get that set up, I may do that in the next few days, and that would probably be wise for the people that would want to come watch that. I'll go ahead and put that information out once I get it done. Then you can go over and subscribe. There won't be any videos up there yet, but the channel will be there. No, I didn't freeze, but I got you, didn't I? Thanks for watching. Let me know in your comments. No. Let me know in my comment. Are they your comments or my comments section? Lately, it's been your comments, not mine. Happy trails.